In this final step to this tutorial, we're going to create a setup sheet. First thing you want to do, come up here, save your work. In fact, I recommend saving periodically throughout the job. Every time you create something new, or every time you create a couple things that are new or modify modifications, go ahead and save your work. To create the setup sheet, it's as simple as creating a 2D drawing. All I'm going to do is come up to my cam tab right here for the part I'm working on. I'm going to right mouse button click and choose drafting. When I do this, I'm going to go to my machine standard templates, hit the plus sign, and I'm going to choose operations with drawings. These are just sample setup sheets. Try this with every single one to see what they do. I'm going to hit the green check mark and now Top Solid is going to do the heavy lifting for us. It's going to create the documents we need to run this job. For example, it's going to tell me who made it, the creation date, total cycle time, the number of tools used, do you have a picture of the tool path, picture of the updated stock model, picture of the part to machine, picture of the cutter, the diameter of the cutter, the gauge distance of the cutter, the fees and speeds, the cycle time of the operation. And if you notice, this has created a eight page setup sheet of this. Every single operation has been documented. What's even cooler than that is the fact that this is a top solid drafting environment. So for example, I can come up here to the detailing tab and I can add critical dimensions that I want my setup guy to check against. I mean, how cool is that?